Hey, welcome back, it's Ari from EntermedSchool.com. Today we are going to solve question number 31 of IMA 2018. So this question talks about genetics and inheritance. And in general, before we begin, you should remember that a girl has XX and a boy will have XY chromosomes. The Y is inherited by the father and the X will be inherited by the mother and XX, one of the X will be inherited by the father and the other will be inherited by the mother. So a condition caused by a dominant allele which means only one allele is enough to show the to show the phenotype of the disease on the X chromosome is passed down through the family individual Z inherit the condition for this family which of the following statement must be correct must be correct assuming no spontaneous mutation have occurred so let's go one by one and see why it's correct or not correct if z is a boy it means he is xy then he must have inherited the dominant allele from his father which is obviously not correct because x chromosomes be, because it's obviously not correct because the disease is x chromosomes and z is a boy which means he got the Y allele from his father, not X allele from his father. If Z was a girl, he was XX, and therefore he would get the X chromosomes from his father, and he would show the disease. But he's a boy, and therefore one is not correct. Let's go. Let's keep going. If Z, if Z is a boy, then one of his mother's parents must have also had the condition. Which is correct, because if you think about it, first of all, for the IMAT, you should know that 99% of the time, a dominant allele will be present as a phenotype, as a disease, in every generation, and it won't skip a generation. And if the mother, parents, have the disease, Therefore, the mother also have the disease and therefore the boy will also have the disease because X chromosomes are inherited from the mother when it comes to males. So, 2 is correct. If Z, the go if Z is a girl, then both of her parents must have the allele. As we said, the dominant allele can be only be inherited from one of the parents. It's one allele is enough to show the phenotype and the disease of this allele. So one parent is enough to give the girl the X allele, the infected X allele, in order to the girl to show the condition. So three is not correct. If Z is a boy and has children, then all of his daughters will have the condition which is obviously correct because the father will always give the X chromosomes to his daughters and because it's a dominant allele all of his daughters will have the condition as they show a single allele that caused the phenotype because one allele is enough to show the disease therefore two and four are correct and our answer is A. Thanks for watching.